Welcome to the push-up competition. Sudden death. Are you ready? Three Thank <laughs> you. 
Alrighty, welcome my lovely little quotables to my cosplay stream. Today I'm going to be making 2P England uh, bookmarks for the prints that I'm selling on my Etsy shop. 
So let's get that started. Because, well, you can, every time you buy a To Be England print on my Etsy store, you get a free To Be England bookmark. So that's what I'm going to be making today. Ooh, someone's already in the chat. Uh, ba -ba -ba. <laughs> yeah, it's going pretty good. Uh, oh, thank you for checking out my channel. I really appreciate it. I'm glad you enjoyed the Wizard 101 stream yesterday. I do those every other day. Uh, you're about to design bears, icons, and overlays for. Oh, thank you. I'll definitely uh, uh, check that out. Hi, Wizard. Hey. Okay, so. Well. Um, before I get started, I hope my audio is actually working well this time. If it's not, please let me know. I have a feeling I'm going to be asking this probably at the beginning of every stream until I get it to the right point where it's actually working well. So, yeah. Okay, so yeah. If the audio is not up to par, like, there's, like... Like the background is too loud, the background music's too quiet, or I'm too loud, or... <laughs> yes, I see the tomatoes. I put that up uh, there for a reason. So everyone can have fun with that. Yes, I see the tomatoes. <laughs> Thank you, wizard. <laughs> But yeah, if the background music's too quiet or too loud, or if I'm too quiet or too loud, please let me know. <laughs> Besides the tomatoes, you can also throw bricks, airplanes, uh, let's see, what other stuff? Uh, bricks, airplanes, apparently you can do the slow clap and also darts, so yeah. <laughs> So, yeah. <laughs> okay. Now I shall start with this big piece of foam. Gonna make the bookmarks. And like I said, if I'm too quiet or too loud, please let me know. Or if the background is too quiet or too loud, please let me know. I. I'm like super OCD with that because I've had issues in the past couple streams with that. So, yeah. Okay. Anywho. Hmm. Let's see, how big should I make this book? I should probably take like a bookmark and size it from that. Okay. This may or may not be a good idea because I'm about to take a bookmark from a book that uh, I have that it's marking the page but i'm sure i can find a way to actually i'll put something to mark that page so i don't lose it because otherwise i'm never gonna find my way back to that page and i will be wondering where the hell am i in that book okay so i shall use this i'm gonna mainly be lurking okay yeah lurking is just fine and dandy <laughs> Lurking, talking, as long as you are enjoying the stream, I am a fine. Because I never want to have a boring stream. I always want to be able to entertain. Uh, I think my dogs are getting at each other. I hear barking. If you guys hear barking in the background, that is my two dogs, Sassy and Yuki. Yuki likes to bug the ever-loving Shinola out of Sassy. So thus you might hear a lot of barking. But yeah. Anywho, so yeah, I'm gonna use this Anime Bonsai uh, bookmark to measure. I think that's like a good distance for a bookmark and yep I think you guys can probably see that pretty well 
if you guys ever have trouble seeing what I'm doing, please let me know. And, oh, hello little Yuki. Okay, so I'm going to use this fabric pen right here. Hopefully that marks it. Yes, it marks it well enough for me to be able to see and cut it. So, yep. Okie dokie. So. And also, just a quick note, you guys. That, um, I know on, like, my streaming schedule, I have it put at, um, the times directly at 3 and directly at 11. There's going to be like just maybe a small time gap between because uh, like I I can never like get it directly on that hour but if you want uh, exact times for when I'm going live uh, like when I'm going to be popping up on screen and talking and all that stuff and it's not just um, the stream starting soon scene that you guys usually see at the beginning of my streams uh i would suggest popping over to like my social media and stuff to see the exact times because i always update on my twitter and instagram the exact times when i'm switching the screen and going live Just, oh also discord i let my discord know as well so if you guys want to pay attention to that too. Just an extra note. Oh, I hope I got that line straight. That's always my biggest problem, drawing straight lines for patterns. Let's see, did that come out well? Okay, it's a little bit over. Let's see, it's not too, like, really seeable and bright so it won't ruin the aesthetic of the bookmark hello yuki bye bye yuki <laughs> she's such a little troublemaker she's like five months old right now that adorable little shih tzu has the energy of i would probably have to say the roadrunner i think that's straight enough what do you guys think looks pretty good yeah I mean it's like the first official bookmark I'm gonna be making if I don't like how it turns out I'll just keep making them I'm gonna keep making them anyways so I can put it with the prints so hey so that's the first side put that there ah all righty and i hope you guys enjoy the music choice that i put on i'm gonna be creating a youtube playlist for that soon enough uh instead of like the techno music because i think just to like mix it up that might be nice i feel like the music may be a touch loud so i'm gonna Turn it down for you guys. Because, I mean, if it's loud on my end, it may be loud on y'all's. But, like I said, if it's ever too quiet, too loud, or if you're having issues hearing me, don't be afraid to speak up. But, yeah. But, um... Okay. But... If then... Can... Pog34, I'm sorry if I butcher that. Thank you so much for the compliment on my Wizard 101 stream. I totally appreciate that. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I have a lot of fun playing that game. And I most definitely uh, will look at that URL when the stream is over. Because uh, I have a little bit of issues of multitasking on just two screens. I really need it. Get, try to find more screens but I promise I'll take a look at it that's so sweet of you to make those that's so cool yeah I totally agree that Wizard 101 is awesome I played it for so many years and then I took like three maybe 
four year break from it and then just went back to playing it just yesterday actually and it's stunning how far they've come with the graphics how they just made it look ten times better I may try to actually do a Wizard 101 cosplay one of these days. I don't know how I'm going to do that, but I may try to. Because, yeah, it's a cool game and it's very underrated. Uh, people think it's like a child's game. I mean, uh, I guess when you first start, the gameplay can seem a little simple but as you go on and stuff the strategy that it takes and uh, when you get past the initial storyline Malister storyline the storyline in all honesty it gets dark but not too dark that won't be a game for all ages because I believe that that game can be is it's for everybody and it's really worth checking out because it's so much fun to play and they've added so much over the years come on fun out you go haha -ha. I win haha -ha. I win again okay so I think that turned out pretty well. Let's see. Yeah. I like that. Looks pretty good. Let's see. I'll be definitely going this side to the other piece, but then again, looking at this thickness here, it may not need another half. Cuz if it's too bulky, then it doesn't really work well as a bookmark. Hmm. Let's see, I'll take like a book I have over here. Slide it in. Oh yeah, I'm sticking with just one side here. Sticking with that. Staying with that. Because else it'll be too bulky. And as for that line right there, I think I'll probably just um like paint over it hmm. probably when I plasti dip it'll cover the um <laughs> the line so that'll work pretty well if I do say so myself but I like how this turned out it's it's gonna be a really cool bookmark okay so <sighs> I also think probably eventually I'm gonna start making like little coasters too because I I was fiddling around with my wood burner and um, let's see if I can just move that over there and you can etch some pretty cool designs into a simple square of foam like I've just done like random little things hello Yuki a little fluffer uh, but yeah I'll bring it closer but yeah just like random dots and stuff and then here you can see him like sort of the cup stain because I didn't plasti dip this this was just practice but I took a wood burner and etched the words uh, do you want a cupcake pop it because that's something that's like frequently said with 2P England, uh, him and his cupcakes. Never ever take a cupcake from 2P England. Main reason, he has a rather special ingredient that he uses in his cupcakes. And that to be human. So, I mean, unless you want to do cannibalism, <laughs> don't eat his cupcakes. It's really a shame that Tupi England isn't a canon character in the anime Hetalia. He really should be. Because the second players are like, um, fan made. Which is a shame. 
Yeah. But yeah, so I may start making coasters because I think that would be pretty cool. There's like a lot of surface area that I could work with. So yeah, I'll move that bookmark over here and I'll begin removing the extra fluff. Um, the bookmark. I hope you y'all's day is going well so far. I know mine. Mine is my day is pretty good so far, aside from like well chores, <laughs> napping. It's funny how when you're a little kid, you don't want to nap. It's like blatant refusal to nap. And then as you get older, <laughs> if I don't get a nap, I be grumpy. I just be grumpy if I don't nap. But yeah. <laughs> uh, well, I'm impressed with how this turned out so far. I really like it. Just have to remove all this little access fluff from it and I gotta remember to make it in the view of you guys else you can't see what I'm doing that's something I frequently forget to do <laughs> but if you didn't mess up you can't learn at least that's what I like to say because you learn from your mess ups <laughs> And I've made a lot of mess ups in cosplay. One of my biggest ones was when I tried making my Dr. Facilier cosplay and I had the bright idea of making a top hat. That, that didn't turn out as I wanted to. That could have gone way better. Because what I tried doing was um making starting out with like how little kids in uh, uh, elementary school make those Lincoln top hats that's how I tried making the uh, top hat for Dr. Facilier at the time I did not know what contact the contact cement was or how to use a heat gun properly or any of the decent practices that a cosplayer should know <laughs> so yeah I like bent the this big piece of foam try to put it into a cylinder and yeah uh, tried to glue it together with hot glue. You can imagine how well that turned out. I'm just surprised the poor thing of that smorgasbord of foam held up for the convention. I'm um, yeah, but at least now I know how not to build a top hat. So yeah, okay, I think that this is well enough, peeled enough foam pieces away, oh, there's foam pieces at the top, gotta deal with those, Let's see, bit by bit, do do do, And then the rest, I believe, I can take care of with a heat gun, which I will need. I'm gonna go, like, kind of away from the camera angle just a little bit to reach over to my equipment box, you guys. Yeah. This sucker right here is going to help me make the edges as smooth as possible. Uh, 
so happy I got one of these things. They are so helpful. I may eventually try to get a stronger one to see if that'll help like mold the foam uh, that I work with into better shapes and stuff and possibly faster uh, make PV, uh, PVC pipe more moldable but for now this little guy he's pretty good all right at the Z camera angle for a second and plug my heat gun in I'll try to keep the heat gun kind of away from the microphone uh, so it's not too loud for you guys but yeah there we go just back and forth Ooh. okay I'm gonna need my trash can really quick because apparently that heat gun is blowing foam bits everywhere. Smart Shania, smart. Uh, not so smart Shania. <laughs> oh. The things that happen on my stream. Come on. Come on, little piece. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, little foam. In you go. Come on. So I don't have a mess everywhere I work. Everywhere I work. Everywhere I work. There we go. Okay. Okay, there's still little foam pieces that I will pick up. Okay, I'm gonna be back in just a second, guys. I just gotta do something. I will be right back.
Alrighty guys, I'm back. Okay, now we start with the heat gun and Shania tries not to burn her hands with the heat gun. Okay, so we use the heat gun and try to smooth out all the edges. Da -ba -da 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 -da. Okay, that's a little bit warm. Uh, you guys can see what I'm doing, yes? Hey, yes, indeed, do zip. Okay, coolio. Awesome. Why does that sound familiar? I don't know. <laughs> uh, I blame being tired and a lot of other things. I'm a bit random. Silly, spastastic, just to name a few qualities. <laughs> but hey, that's what makes me, me, me. And I just blew a piece of foam onto the ground. I'll just pick it up later. But this will smooth it out, she says, hopefully. Hello, Yuki. Back again, I see. Mm hmm. Move it up. Oh, ah, that's warm. Ow. Okay. Putting a pause on that. I have a heat resistant glove for a reason. Come on, where is it? Huh, should have used this in the first place. <laughs> I preach safety first, yet. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, what are you? Anywho, let's get back to this and hope I actually do not burn my hands. And I have a puppy watching me while I work. <laughs> Adorable little bugger. Okay. So, can you guys see what I'm doing? Yes, I'll adjust the camera just a little bit. Up, 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 up. Up. There we go. That should be good. Okay. That should work. <laughs> I do not know why I have the tune in my head. I get random songs stuck in my head. Isn't that just lovely when the randomest crap gets stuck in your head and you don't even know what it's from? I swear that happens to me on a daily basis. Like, almost every day, I get something random. Uh, like, random tunes stuck in my head. Well, at least it's not like an annoying song or anything. Because then, that would be kind of torture. Because the other day, a co-worker of mine decided uh, to get the song from the Lego movie stuck in my head. Uh, you guys know the one, you know the Everything is awesome Everything is cool when you're part of a team Yeah. And then my managers joined in and yeah, they were like hell-bent on getting that song stuck in my head. <laughs> it's like, it, it was something else, I tell you what guys. It was something else. Hmm. Yeah, this is so much better now that I'm actually using this glove. 
I need to practice what I preach because I'm constantly saying if you're working with like really smelly fumes, uh, wear like a respirator mask thingamabobber. If you're dealing with really hot stuff, be careful, all of that. And yet I don't sometimes use the tools that I say use. And that, that's not smart. I myself will say that isn't smart what I do sometimes. But I'm only human. And humans make mistakes. Yes, indeed, they do. Okay, I think that's enough. Don't want to, like, get this bent out of shape. Because we need a bookmark to be flat. Because <sighs> if the bookmark's not flat, I don't think it'll do really anything good with, well, bookmarking. So, yeah. <laughs> so, I'll roll that back up. <laughs> the other day I had This is Halloween stuck in my head. That was fun. I mean, it is a good song. It's just, when it gets stuck in your head, it will not come out. Because it was stuck for like... Mm, two or three hours after my stream. And that was something. Uh. All right. Uh, come on. Get the extra crumple off. Hmm. This has like kind of extra edge. I'm gonna try smoothing that out. Or I could try sanding it. Okay. I'm not gonna try cutting it because that's not. Uh. A good idea because knowing me I'm just gonna like cut off a huge chunk and then poop goes the bookmark but I think we've got all the little tiny furry foam edges off oh wait nope there's the ones on the bottom gotta get those you guys will probably notice that I'm a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to my cosplay or my art in general. I know I shouldn't always strive perf bleh, 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 bleh. Tongue tied. Strive for perfection, but I can't help it. I want things to look good. Cause yeah. But yeah, I think I'll take care of that little extra edge when I'm off stream with my sander. Sadly, I can't stream the really heavy duty equipment that I like to use. I would love to show you guys that stuff, but I don't have like extra cameras to do that. One day when I get a studio, I plan to have like the ultimate setup where like I can show you guys sanding, plasti dipping, uh, cutting on uh, like um, the wood cutting machines for some reason the word escapes me I don't know why uh, but yeah uh, just everything I just have like this awesome dream to have the, this big beautiful studio just right off of my dream house and I can stream all of the process and just yeah it's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna get it. I'm determined. Anywho, that looks good so far. Now to get the foam shavings back into the trash can. Well, into the trash can because they weren't originally in the trash can. <laughs> Also, probably something you guys notice, I ramble a lot, like a lot, but sometimes 
fun conversations come from rambling. Okay, now to plug in my little wood burner. This particular tool I have to be really careful with because that sucker can hurt if I touch the end of it. So, yeah, I should probably try making like a little Palmer clay stand for it. I may actually do that on this stream. I don't know yet. Yeah, come on, plug it in. Oh, careful. Yeah, plug it in, plug it in. Ah, careful. <sighs> okay, and now set that to warm up. Careful for it not to touch it, because else that is a very bad thing if I touch the end of that sucker. <laughs> Ah, okay. So while I'm waiting for that to warm up, I'm gonna just clean up a little bit. There, there. Sorry if this stream seems a little slow, you guys. Sleep deprived Shania isn't the most energetic Shania. But, uh, ah. Uh, is what happens when you get not enough sleep because of a medical issue, which I shall not discuss, but it, let me just say it, it's a pain in the ass. But that is why we have cafe. Ah. Coffee is amazing. Whoever invented it is the awesomest person. You know? While I'm waiting for that wood uh, burner tool thing, my bobber can't come up with the word. I'm gonna look up who invented coffee, cause why not? All right, Google. Who invented coffee? George Constant Washington. Okay. Oh, and it gives even a little thing here. Let's see. So, this dude invented coffee in 1906. An English chemist, George Constant Washington, invented the first mass-produced instant coffee. Hmm, cool. Washington was living in Guatemala. Eh, makes sense. And at that time, when he observed dry coffee on his coffee carafe, after experimenting, he created Red E Coffee, the brand name for his first instant coffee. Wait, so that's instant coffee, but like, how did it originate, originate? Let's see. Yemen, ooh, the monks created it. Okay, that's cool. Because Yemen traders brought coffee beans uh, from Ethiopia. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let's see. The earliest credible evidence of either coffee drinking or knowledge of the coffee tree appears in the middle of the 15th century in Yemen's Sufi Monasteries. Okay. And then coffee beans were first explored from Ethiopia. Alright, alright. That's cool. Go Yemen. Go Ethiopia. <laughs> smart people. Very, very, very smart people. All right. So that's how coffee was invented, folks. <laughs> and I think probably, oh yeah, yep. Yeah. Smoke is coming off of this sucker. That means this is more than heated up. So I'm gonna adjust the camera angle just a bit. Whoop, no, 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 yep. Okay, there, so you guys can see what I'm doing. 
gonna like turn off the heat just so I, I don't burn the whole straight through the bookmark and now we commence the foam burning so last time when I tried this I tried making a quote on the bookmark but I couldn't fit all the words so I'm just gonna put the character name so <coughs> mamma mia okay apparently other parts of the wood burner are hot ow good to know ow okay so There we go. Easy peasy. Try not to get burned because getting burned is bad. Getting burned hurts. So far so good, it looks like each letter is fitting. Alright. Awesome sauce. I really love this tool, it works pretty well. Might be a bit of a cool shave, but... Not too bad, not too bad. Gonna heat it up a little bit more so I can make the N and the D a little bit deeper. But hey, I'll turn it towards the camera a little bit so you guys can see it. Not too bad if I do say so myself. Okay, I sounded Irish for a split second there. Like a really bad Irish accent. I apologize to anyone who's Irish who's watching this. That was a really bad accent. <laughs> okay. Not, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Okay, I think it's kind of warmed up a little bit more. I ain't going to test it on anything. Well, I have a scrap piece of foam here. I could do that if I tear it off. Come on, tear off. Like, give me a tiny piece. Come on. Okay, Let's see if I can set that down with that. Mm, this might not end well. Let's hope it ends well. Okay, screw that. I value my fingers and anything that could get burned. Okay, let's just hope that it works here. Ooh, yeah. Much, much better. That's my... Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That, that my friends, that looks so much better. Oh yeah, I like how that looks. Okay, so slip that two off and let that sucker cool off. Let's see, how can I make it cool off without hurting any of my nice little equipment? and me. That works. Okay. If you guys can't see it, I just, because uh, eh, it's probably out of view, but I put my wood burner on a little tiny stand. I'll move the camera just ever so slightly so you can see it. Yeah, I put it right there. Yeah. So it's just a little bit upwards. 
So yeah. So while that's cooling off, I'm gonna get another tool. One thing I hate about leather chairs is that when wearing shorts, you will stick to the chair. And that is so annoying when I stick to my own chair. Okay, well, where did I put my little hole punch thing? Because I don't want to use a wood burner to make the hole punch. Ah uh, ha ha! There you are. There you are, my pretty. <laughs> Sounded like a bit of a witch for a minute. <laughs> and in case the sound is a little soft or I speak too softly, you guys, which feel free to let me know, as usual. Uh, I said I sounded like a witch, not a biatch. Just clarifying. I mean, sometimes I can be a bit of a one, but yeah, that's a story for another day. That's a story for another day. Okay, let's get this tool out without completely disturbing the probably still warm wood burner. Okay, come on. It needs to come back out. It can't come back out. Okay, those of you who have watched uh, the ventriloquist Jeff Dunham, You'll know what I meant when I said that. If you haven't watched Jeff Dunham, I am so sorry you have not watched funny, good quality ventriloquy. Okay, so I'm going to use this tool right here to make a tiny hole right, mm, I say probably like right here or here. Hmm. Because you'll read it like that. So, yeah. Like, ooh, yeah, right here. Right here in the foam. Mm. Then I'll slide this tool. Me, bums away. Onto my bed. Oh, I didn't mean you, bums away. Oh, hello, Yuki. I talk about Yuki a lot in the stream. So I'll set, pop goes my whole puncher. Okay. Oh, Yuki doesn't want, want to be uh, on camera at the moment. She backed away. Step on little fluffer. <coughs> A roof. No, I'm not trying to play. <coughs> A roof. <coughs> Yuki is currently talking <coughs> back to me. Hey, you, come here. Come here. Come. Come on, come on, come on, smile for the camera. Hey, I win. This is the little squirt I've been talking about. Say hi, Yuki. Hello. Okay, you little barker are going to be on my lap since I'm not dealing with anything dangerous at the moment and the wood burner is very far away from us. So you can't get hurt, so I can't risk that because I would not want you to be hurt. That's the last thing I want. Okay, so, my little lovely, I now have a backseat streamer <laughs> named Yuki. And in case you guys are wondering, she is full Shih Tzu and also full troublemaker. She gives me a run for my money sometimes, eh? No, no, Yuki. No, no. Okay, the wood burner's still warm. Actually, even though you are an adorable backseat streamer, I'm not risking anything happening. So, say bye bye. Bye bye. Mwah. Oh, yes, you're such a cutie. And you know it. Okay, go so we'll say hi to your sister and mama. Okay? Or stay here. Either way. <laughs> Cute little rugrat. Just don't get in the way because I don't want anything to happen. 
Alrighty, so now we shall make the hole for the string for the bookmark. Right there, I think. Right there. It's good marking. And pull back. Haha. -ha. Pull back. Haha. -ha. Pull back. Haha. -ha. Did it go through? Haha! <laughs> I'll bring it closer to the camera so you guys can see. A perfect hole in the foam. Ah, oh, that's awesome. I love when that happens. Magnifique. <laughs> yes, I'm weird, I know. Yuki just gave me a... You are such a weird human look. All dog owners out there know to look. Okay, now reach across. Hello. What was that? Okay, what was that? Oh, oh, thank God. That was only the, phew, that was only the ruler. Good, I'm glad nothing extremely important like fell down. Mm. <sighs> Funny, the one thing I get slightly hurt on happens to be the opener of the whole punch box. That's hilarious. So go back in. Go back in. Go back in. Go back in. There we go. Go over here. All right. So now that we have that, uh, I don't have a string at the moment, but I will find some, probably off stream. But, yeah. Wait a sec. Mmm. I mean, with a few cuts, the string could work. Hmm. It's rustic. Kind of boho. Well, this is the first ever bookmark. I'm going to see how it looks. So, I'm going to go reach over here and see. Let's see. see how that looks and just snip 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 come on snip come on come on come on oh bugger come on works well enough Sort of. Actually, no, this keeps de-threading itself, so I'm not going to work with that. I'm just going to throw that away. So off stream, I'll probably attach a string. I am going to be streaming, uh, making the bookmarks later tonight, too, at my 11 o'clock night owl stream. So if you guys want to catch that, too, uh, this will probably be more finished, possibly, well, strung up. But yeah, I'm going to be making more bookmarks around uh, in my 11 o'clock stream. But I'm going to go quickly off camera just for a second to grab my polymer clay. Come on. Come on. Ah ha ha. Okay. The giant box of polymer clay poof it's like it's a big box has lots of clay see yeah Ooh. and everything is falling okay has that warm uh, cooled down yet no it, it, it's still gonna stay there okay 
Yeah, put that there. Drink some more coffee out of my Todoroki mug, which is awesome. I was so happy to find that mug uh, at a box lunch because the usually heat changing anime mugs are like 50, 60. I got that for 18 bucks. I was happy. Okay, so. Yes, I actually have brown clay. Finally, these clays get use. Pink clay, perfect. Because with the bookmarks, they're gonna have character-specific charms to them. So, I'll just put that on the bed for now. And I shall start with the modeling of the cupcake because that fits Oliver to a T. Oh, that's a brand new block. Oh, I love opening up brand new blocks of clay. It's awesome. Because it's so fresh and not touched. I love it. Okay, so I'll put this aside. Move that there. Move that down. Move this down. I only need like a good chunk of you. Yep, that'll work. And now Put it back in the zippy bag. Da 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 da. Squeeze the air out. Boop. And now take the pink, also on a slightly newish bag piece thing. Eh. Take that. Open it a little bit. Now, since this will be the top of the cupcake, I'll need like a tiny chunk. Maybe a bit more. No, not that much. Yeah, I think that'll work. Okay. Awesome sauce. Okay. Boop. Beep bop boop 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 bop bop boop beep bop boop 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 I don't know why I'm talking like a robot. Da da da. Okay, so let's start just like molding the clay, making sure it's. Good consistency. <laughs> ah, I love working with polymer clay. It's always been like a favorite of mine to work with. I think I'll use the other side of it. Wow. Well, yeah. my hands better. Oh man. Oh, teeny. Yep. Then fix that. Roll, 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 If you guys are wondering why I'm not making it like s perfectly spherical, it's so I can do this. Squish, 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 
fish. And it's like that might weigh that low. Mm. Let's see. You never know unless you try. I just realized this also kind of may look like a bit of like one of those little emoji boos. Ooh well. Okay. So you shape it, you shape it, you shape it. Trying to make it look better. Smooth it, smooth it out. Smooth, 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 smooth. Gotta make it smooth. Mm -hmm. Let's see, how long have we been going already? Right. Wow, hour and 15. Nice. Getting better with each stream, I believe. that little bump out. You'll notice, guys, that I sing random songs a lot, especially when I'm just trying to fill in, like, spaces where I don't have too much to say. But yeah. It would probably help if I were to unplug the wood burner. That would probably help it, like, cool off more. Yeah. Okay. Come on. Smooth up the bump. Smooth, 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 smooth. Smooth out the bumps. Smooth out the bumps. Smooth out the bumps. Bumpy lumps. Okay, let's get some detailing utensils. No, the phone. Oh, falling. Thing is falling. Can't have that, can we? Oh, butterscotch. At least one thing has to happen in each stream. I swear. <laughs> Alright. So, what tool will be a good tool to use? One sec, guys. I shall be back. Give me one moment. Alrighty guys, 
I am back. Clickety clack. Okay. So, all right. Spin, spin, spin. And now we start detailing the bottom part of the cupcake. Okay. So. I'll use this part. And I'll square it off a little. Probably won't turn out as well as I hope, but hey, it's the first time I'm making this. So everything can be and will be improved. So Can you guys see it? What I'm doing. Yeah, sort of. Okay. But I'm drawing lines on the brown clay to make sort of like that cupcake lines. So yeah. I wish my hands weren't so shaky. Curses. with the shaking. I am trying to create art and with your shaking I cannot create the art. Don't you guys just hate it when you're trying to do like super detailed work and your hands decide, nope, you're not gonna do well on that. I'm gonna start shaking and causing all kinds of problems. Yeah. That's what my hands are doing now. And it's ticking me off. So, this one may not turn out like I want it to. But, it'll be a good first try. And that's what I can only hope for. A good first try. Because I can always learn from my mistakes. Because that's how you learn, by making mistakes. Okay. So, here. Yeah. You might want to move your hands. Yeah. It's kind of hard when you're doing detailed work. But 
this is what I was doing. I was making lines in the cupcake. Yeah. Sorry for my hands blocking the view. <laughs> but yeah. Lines in the cupcake. That is what I was trying to do. Emphasis on the trying because my hands are kind of like starting to shake like a lot. So, my hands don't exactly like me at the moment. But yeah. But that is the cupcake right now. I'll show again the what I tried to do for the detailed work. This right here. Oh yeah. Okay, and now to make the frosting. So I'll set this aside right here. And now I shall make the frosting. That should probably be a little bit easier. Especially if I like maybe move my hands up a little. I hope you guys can see that a lot better. Gonna like roll it into a ball. Da, da, da. And then like, sorry if my hands cover it a little bit. Trying my best. Hmm, the frosting's actually turning out, out a lot better. There we go. And then just like. Ooh. Okay, not too bad. And then. Okay, that, that, that's actually not that bad. I'm actually kind of impressed with that. <laughs> I was expecting uh, it to turn out a lot worse. But yeah. Da, 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 da. I hope you guys could tell it's a cupcake. Then I'm going to make like a little... Hmm. Where should I make the little incision so I can... Put like a little jump ring. There would be a good part to do with that. Huh, let's try in the bottom. Like I said, first bookmark. So you can always see what works, what doesn't. Boop. All right. So then, off stream, I'll like plasti dip it and then basically repeat the process probably be a little bit more energized then and uh, yeah so my next stream today is going to be at 11 p.m. Uh, mountain time so yeah gonna cut off the stream for now it was fun uh, showing you guys like how I'm making the bookmark and the cupcake that I'm actually surprised that turned out pretty well for the first time making a small little tiny cupcake I can only get better and so yeah so if you want to continue watching uh, me make more bookmarks tune into my stream uh, uh, later tonight at 11 and then tomorrow I'll be back at it again with wizard 101 uh, wait no tomorrow today's Wednesday Tomorrow's Thursday. Yeah, no. Tomorrow I won't be streaming because that's one of my days off. Um, just like Sunday. So I won't be streaming tomorrow, but um, Friday I'll be streaming. I'll be back at it again with Wizard. So yeah. Forgot what day it was for a second there. So yeah. 
bye for now. See you guys at 11. Hope you guys enjoyed watching me um, create this bookmark. Talk to y'all later. Quody, Shania, Naya, 